We kind of match. <laughs> Do we? <laughs> yeah. When your boyfriend's colorblind. Hello guys, it is Thursday, the big day. Y'all already know what day it is. We are heading literally to the airport right now. It is 6.19 oh, p.m. Can you see that? Wow. Sun tea. It is sun tea all right. This is a great angle, honestly. I, I look really good. I'm feeling um, highly anxious. I know a lot of you guys were asking me to be posting updates because a lot of you, thank you by the way, for so many of you that left such amazing comments on that vlog. It made me feel so much better. It made me feel validated and understood because as an anxious person, you can kind of tend to like focus on the negative and then you feel like you're being negative and then you stress about it and you feel like people are gonna like think that you're just this negative Nancy or whatever, but it's like your anxiety is trying to like protect you or whatever. There's a reason why you're stressed because your brain is like, help. Ah, Something bad's gonna happen. By your flight, right? Yeah. But we're gonna make it. We're gonna, okay. It's fine. I'm gonna make it. This is the longest flight I've ever taken by myself. 11 episodes of Teen Mom. Oh. I've got my Teen Mom um, downloaded. Drew is taking me to the airport. We're like saying bye to each other and we're sad. We just had like a moment in the kitchen. I was like, oh my God, I'm pathetic. Stop. I was just like clutched onto oh, him like, mm. this is the longest we've been apart since we've been together, we were just saying. But next time, Drew's for sure coming. It's just with his work schedule, it would have never worked out. Plus this is like a girl's trip. Okay, here we go. London, baby. London, I can't even say that yet because I'm too anxious. But like, if you guys saw my last vlog and if you watch Friends, that's gonna be me as soon as I get there. But until then, I'm a little, I'm a little on edge, but we'll check in with you guys once I get through security. Okay, not off to a great start. There's people going all the way to the escalator. Yikes. Something about me when I get anxious is I get really quiet and that is why I haven't updated you guys at all because I have just been silently freaking out. But getting ready to board. Here we go. I got this. Thank you so much. Where I wish I was right now. Damn. As I just walked on board, I passed a staircase to an upper level. I thought that was only in movies. Apparently, that's real. I need to be richer. Made it into my seat. Got my pillow. Got my blanket. I'm really doing this. I'm really doing this. Holy shit. Thank 
this moment would come. But we made it. I'm in London. We freaking did it. Wow. I slept for an hour on the flight, by the way. That's great. Jasmine's here waiting. Alexa's landing in like 30 minutes. I'm now heading to customs. Wish me luck. Two hours later. You guys, holy shit. That was the craziest experience of my life. Um, I just got pulled over by customs and interrogated and questioned. And I had to sit there for like an hour while they asked me questions and verified these questions. They asked me every single question you could ever imagine about myself. How much money I make? What do I do? How much money does my boyfriend make? How long have we been together? How much money does Jasmine make? What kind of videos does she make? Can they look at my YouTube videos to verify? Don't travel if you're a YouTuber. <laughs> not fun. I had a feeling, like, I don't know why, just that whole time I was standing in line, I just had this weird feeling, and your girl got stopped. That was insane, but I'm on my way to Jasmine now. Alexa has to go through the same thing. She's right behind me. I literally just can't believe how this has happened. I might do a story time about it, because this would only happen to me, so. You guys, look who I found! Um, you guys are gonna have to watch her vlog for us, like, first meeting. <laughs> it was the most stressful was hour so of my funny. life. I literally <laughs> thought I was going to like airport sent jail. <laughs> I literally was thinking, okay, I'm gonna get sent back. Like, I don't know why, <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I'm gonna have to make an entire story time about that because that was the craziest experience. Like we both got interrogated. Interrogated. Quite literally interrogated. <laughs> but now we've stopped at a little, what is what was that called? Uh, it was WH Smith. WH Smith. And I got a little <laughs> veggie sandwich and I got some cheese and onion crisps. My breath is gonna be kicking. And I also got a Sprite, which to me tastes a little sweeter, but it also might be that I haven't had a Sprite in a while. We're waiting for Alexa to go through the same exact <laughs> line that I just went through. I'm and so like ready to pick up my phone and go through the mm -hmm. interrogation again. So, she was, she, sorry, she was literally like, <laughs> she was like, the customs so, lady. She was like, so who do you live with? I was like, Nathan, she was like, so what does he do? And where is he? So why is he not home? Mm -hmm. So where does he live? And she I'm asked like, me how much what, what money my boyfriend made. I was like, what does that have to do with it? When she asked me what Nick did, I, I don't really know what Nick does. Like, he doesn't have an official job title. Mm -hmm. So I was like, oh, he's a... Uh, and then I said, energy consultant. And then I was like, oh my God, please don't let that hesitation like <laughs> no, kick me I out know, of England. <laughs> I like literally, she asked me what Nick did. I go, I don't know. I don't even know his last name. I've never met him. And she was like, well, then how do you know Jasmine? I was like, well, cause she came over, blah, blah, blah. And she was like, and what were the dates that she came over? I was like, oh God, yeah, October. Yeah. And she said to me as well. And I was like, I think it's October. And then I was like, my memory is the worst. I was trying to text her, but then I was trying not to look like I was texting on my phone. Cause yeah, yeah. I didn't want it to look like I was like trying Giving to pull off some scam. Yeah. But I was like, FYI, they're gonna ask you a lot of questions. Also, this is our friend. We've yeah. just been sitting here with this her between Susan. us. <laughs> oh, actually, it's Nikki. I got it wrong. Hayden is here, and she is hanging out with us. I think I've been out of focus this entire time. Cool, love that for me. <laughs> yeah, I'm eating my sandwich, and we're waiting on Alexa, and hopefully we don't get stuck in too bad of rush hour traffic. Jasmine has to go home and upload a video as well, so we're on like a time crunch. So, we've got. I have hope. <laughs> this day has to have like something good happen. Please. <laughs> One hour later. You guys, we're still here. I'm back with my friend. Three hours late. You guys, it's literally been three hours. It's three ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Hours. Alexa now is just. Alexa was in that line for two hours. Yeah. I was in the line for what, like an hour and a half? And then got interrogated. Yes, that child is screaming. We don't know if it's okay or not. It's been screaming for literally an hour. Anyways, Alexa is supposedly walking up now. I can't believe that I spent three extra hours in this freaking airport. Like I said, Said, I gotta make a story time about it and we will discuss it then but wow what what a day already a few moments later she made it two hours later oh I haven't seen you in like a few days I'm just feeling slightly claustrophobic back here it's really hard to tell but this is the tiniest yeah you can't tell at all oh my gosh Alexa it looks like you're driving but you're not what the heck Made it. Um, I don't know. I don't know the last thing I filmed. I don't know the last thing I said. We were at the airport for three and a half hours. We had just like a day, and now we finally made it back 
to Jasmine's place and we've got like gotten settled in. Jasmine uploaded her video. Now we're gonna go to Wagamama for dinner, which I'm very excited about because I've always seen it in <laughs> vlogs. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I need to stop vlogging so we can go. So we came to this little mall area. It's cute. And we're gonna get some dinner and it's so cute. We're on like a little girl's date night. There's a pizza hut. I'm right at home. Oh, cheeky Nando's. <laughs> Our first meal in the UK <laughs> is good old Wagamama. Is it Sakura? Um, yeah. You guys, we got a huge feast over here. I'm so happy. It's like some kind of vegan ramen type of noodle bowl thing. Looks delish. A salad. I got some vegan chicken katsu, like curry katsu. Jasmine got this like udon bowl that's so good. I already ate, ate so much of it. And then this freaking cauliflower. <laughs> What's it called? Bang Bang Cauliflower? Oh my gosh, it's so good. I obviously didn't eat the cilantro. <laughs> we know this. This is for you, Drew. I'm gonna enjoy it for both of us. All right, guys, we made it. Alexa and I are in our beds. She's in there somewhere. <laughs> good night, Jasmine. Welcome back. The best, the best host ever. We're very well taken care of here, but yeah, guys, had a shower. Didn't even remember to eat my ice cream, which is depressing. We're going to bed. We'll see you in the morning. Keep your fingers crossed for me that I won't be up all night in the middle of the night, which I probably will. Okay, good night.